Hello, my name is Dr. Gill. I've been asked for an examination of your hands today. Would that be okay? Yes. Super. Before we start, uh, could you confirm your name and date of birth? My name is Abby Tut and I was born on the 7th of December 96. Thank you. If I can get you to start by putting your hands on, on the pillow for me. And I'm going to see if I can see any abnormalities here as I look over your hands. And if you could turn your hands over the other side for me. That all looks okay. Now, before we carry on, do you have any pain in any of your joints on your hands at all? No. Super. So I'm just going to press over your hands and see if I can feel anything unusual. I'm just going to turn it same again to find the this pain. Okay, if you could turn your hands over for me. I'll do the same again. I'm going to squeeze over all of your joints, so please tell me if there's any discomfort to this. I'm just going to squeeze over the tops. It's comfortable. No problems when I do that. Okay. I'm just going to get you to put your arms up like so for me. No, I'm just going to just check, check down over the borders. That looks fine, thank you. And if you just put your hands back forward. And now we're going to do some movements, if you wouldn't mind. So what I'm going to do first is if you can just make a fist for me. Okay, and then relax. And turn your hands over. And spread your fingers up and out as best you can. Excellent. Now if you just relax for me and let me move your fingers, make sure there's no problems there. Any discomfort as I do this? Yeah. Super. Okay. So if I can get you to squeeze my fingers as hard as you can, make a fist, try and break them, really go for it, that's fine. And relax. So we're going to do some uh, other movements with your fingers now. So if you could just um, try and move your fingertip towards you. So that's it. Thank you. And then move the whole of your finger to touch your palm as best you can. Excellent. Relax for me. And we'll do the same again on this side. And then move the whole of your finger. Wonderful. And if you could just bend the, th bend the thumb for me. Okay, and relax. I'll do the same again over here. And bend the thumb. And relax. We're now just going to do some small movements of the fingers. And I'm going to try and stop you doing those movements. And if you could pick your hands up like so. And I'm going to take your fingers. Don't let me push them down. And same again. Don't let me push them down. That's fine. And if you could put your hands like so with your thumbs up. Don't let me push them down. Now you push me down, okay, that's fine. Turn your hands over and put your thumbs upwards. And again, don't let me push them down. And you push me down. Super. Um, if you could put your thumb to your little fingers for me. Excellent. And now if you could put your hands like so in a prayer sign, bring them nice down at 90 degrees, that's excellent. Any problems with that? No. Okay. And we'll turn over and we'll do it the other way now. Any issues with that? No. Super. And if we go back here, we're just going to test some of the nerves to do with your hands. So again, if you can make the OK sign for me, and don't let me pull through. If you could spread your fingers wide as you can, and don't let me close them. I'm just going to get a bit of paper, and what I'd like you to do is I'd like you to take it between your thumbs like so for me, and don't let me pull it back. Excellent. Black for me. And then we're going to put the same paper between your little and ring finger. And again, don't let me pull it out. Relax for And we'll do the same again on the other side, between your little and ring finger. Okay, thank you. So that completes our examination. I haven't found any issues with your hands. Do you have any questions with, for me before we finish? No. Super. Thank you very much.